Give me your tired. Your poor. Your huddled masses. Yawning to breathe free. The wretched refuse of your teeming shore. Send these, the homeless. Tempest tossed to me. I left my lamp beside the golden door. The International Institute of New England has presented the Golden Door Award for more than 40 years. It is traditionally conferred upon a U.S. citizen of foreign birth who has led an exemplary life of accomplishment, someone who embraces the principles of our organization and who has lifted high a lamp to guide others along the way. Our 2017 honoree is Dr. Nubar Afan. Born in Beirut, Lebanon, of Armenian heritage, Nubar and his family moved to Montreal, Canada to escape the Lebanese Civil War and subsequently emigrated to the U.S. in 1983 to pursue a Ph.D. in biochemical engineering at MIT. Well, I've been involved with biotechnology since 1989, and for many years now, Nubar's name is one of the names you hear as leaders in the community. And it's not commonly understood that the biotech industry has benefited greatly from people that were born outside the United States and then have been successful here. Nubar's a prime example of that. Nubar, from his earliest days that I saw, grad student days, he was not only brilliant, persistent, and committed. Nubar showed himself as being very innovative in his thought process. He was thinking grandly from the very beginning. Nubar, I would describe as an American original. And one sense of that word is that he's unusual in his combination of intellect and creativity. Another way to understand being original is to originate things, to have the courage and the imagination to start essentially with a blank sheet of paper, imagine a future that would be better, and then to develop ideas and then to translate those ideas to make that future happen. And in that sense of being an original, Nubar really stands out. Since MIT and the founding of his first company, Perceptive Biosystems, Nubar Afayan's extraordinary career as an investor has seen the founding of more than 40 companies in the life sciences, healthcare, and sustainability sectors. The resulting innovations from flagship portfolio companies help to transform lives and move humanity into new therapies, treatments, and methods of sustainability. There's a constant theme in our discussions at Flagship related to not just how can we make one company successful or whether a scientific idea merits attention, but how can we make a difference in the world? And I think that a lot of that is motivated by Nubar's heritage and our common heritage. Through the innovations fueled by flagship pioneering, Nubar Afayan influences the future. But as an immigrant, he remains ever mindful of the past. His pride in his Armenian heritage and his role as a standard bearer for the Armenian diaspora make him a philanthropic champion for refugees and emigrants across the globe. American society provides a kind of freedom to create and to have an impact for those who are willing to take advantage of it. Nubar has consistently embraced that opportunity and in fact, I think, takes it as a responsibility. He's a tough guy because he's so accomplished and so persistent. But what he did later on, when he started getting involved with Armenia, it was basically his heart now starting to take over and direct his brain as to what were the kinds of things that he wanted to do with himself and with his life. Connecting the past to the present, the spirit of humanity creates a bridge to a more just world in the future. In 2015, he co-founded the Aurora Humanitarian Initiative and the Aurora Prize for Awakening Humanity. The Aurora Initiative has also launched the 100 Lives Initiative, a remembrance project that preserves the stories of both survivors and their saviors of the Armenian Genocide. The Golden Door Award is an honor that we give out to someone who was born outside of the United States who has made great contributions to this country. So this award reminds us of who we are, it reminds us of why immigrants are important for our community, and it helps us to recognize that because of people who were born outside of the United States, like New Barafayan, New England is what it is today. To honor him with the Golden Door Award is to me a superb representation 
of what is intended by the Statue of Liberty, saying that here we have a golden door open. That's something we should never forget, that this country was made by folks who came here with nothing and then built on their own. He is constantly proposing ways of looking at the world which compel everybody around him to reconsider how they're looking at the world. And Nubar's achievements show what can happen when the immigrant is given that opportunity to achieve.